Hey what's up guys, Fahasman here. In this video, I am going to talk about how to copy a DVD with Windows or Mac. There are many reasons why you might want to copy a DVD. Maybe your favorite movie is crashed or you want to create a digital backup for your computer. Whatever the reason, copying a DVD can be a great way to keep your movies safe and accessible. But copying DVD is not always straightforward. That's where DVD Fab comes in. It's a powerful and professional DVD copy software that lets you easily copy any type of DVD or Blu-ray to a blank disk, your computer or a hard drive. So head over to the DVD Fab website. The download link is available in the video description. You can download the software for free. Once downloaded, install and launch DVD Fab. The main interface is clean and straightforward. On the left hand side, we have different buttons like Home, Copy, Reaper, Converter, Creator, DVD Fab Products. So if you click on Copy, you can copy and burn DVD or Blu-ray disc to blank DVD. Here you can see we have different options like Full Disc. You can copy all content of the disc, ISO or folder source. And with Main Movie, you can copy the main movie title of the disc. And if you click on customize, you can copy any content you want from the disk. You can split one DVD 9 into two DVD 5. And you can merge multiple DVDs. We have clone burn. You can clone DVD or Blu-ray disk. Copy and convert DVD to Blu-ray format. And convert Ultra HD to Blu-ray format. And copy and convert Blu-ray to Ultra HD. Each mode is designed for different purposes. So choose the one that best suits your needs. So insert the DVD you want to copy into the optical drive. DVD Fab will automatically load the content. You can also load the source manually by clicking plus or add button or simply drag and drop the ISO file or folder to the program. After the source is loaded, DVD Fab will automatically synchronize all its meta info and remove any DVD protection embedded. If you are curious about what kind of copy protection is embedded in your DVD, just click the option Info and find out. Then you can choose the output as DVD 5 or DVD 9 based on the selected copy mode. You can select the titles, chapters, audio tracks and subtitles you want to keep in the copy. Click on Advanced Settings. You can see the volume label and select the output as DVD 5 or DVD 9. You can also set other options including copying, removing and navigation. Before starting to copy your DVD, you can also preview the content to ensure you get exactly DVD copy what you want. And then navigate to the bottom of the main interface to select our directory. To select your optical drive as the directory from the drop down list box if you want to copy the source to a blank disk. Or you can select a directory by clicking the image icon if you want to clone the DVD as an ISO image file. To select a directory by clicking the folder icon if you want to copy the DVD to your hard drive as a DVD video folder then click the start button to initiate the DVD copying process. The copying process will be displayed in detail. DVD Fab will copy your DVD quickly and efficiently. That's it with DVD Fab DVD copy, creating backup or digital copies of your DVDs is a breeze. The download link of this software is available in the video description. With DVD Fab, you can create a backup copy of your DVDs or transferring them to your computer is a breeze. It's fast, easy to use and can handle even the most copy protected disk. So thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe for more tech tutorials and leave a comment below if you have any question about DVD Fab. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.